now? I just received the invoice from the company I'm buying the apartment from and this is going to be my first apartment on the company's name. We already have one property in Denmark with Adina and now we will have another one in Bucharest. When did we buy the Denmark one? 2019. Yeah. 2019 we bought that. 2020 we finished the repairs. I had 100,000 plus in my stock portfolio. And now the highlight of 2021 is going to be moving to Romania and buying this property here. Yes, and this uh, this apartment is brand new. We will be the first ever yeah. owners. Yeah. So it's very nice and we also have a garage space. But yeah. all of this you will see in the next parts. Yes. just got everything for the apartment yeah. and now we have to do some more tasks before it's finalized but yeah it's ours now it's yours yeah. my company is not mine yeah Barrett is on the way to pick up the key for his first apartment Now we are standing at the border of Bulgaria and like that's the funny thing the countries which are like underdeveloped they are like having the most strict checks and the countries which are like more developed they are like just yeah letting you through um, and that's how it looks like Republic of Bulgaria It just took us one and a half hours from, from Bucharest yeah. We were actually very surprised that mm. we are already in Bulgaria yeah, yeah we were like it cannot be like how is it possible and I was really expecting an autobahn the entire way. There was no autobahn. It was just like these normal roads coming here. So, but I, I'm pretty sure they will make drama now. The buildings here are completely falling apart. I think I've never seen worse buildings in the entire European Union anywhere else other than Bulgaria. Like, Barat is officially German. That's that's definitely a massive step down even Complaining from Romania. Complaining about each and everything. The roads, the water is filled up in one entire lane. So if you would drive through that, the water, the car will just float. And we actually wanted to register <laughs> in Bulgaria. We wanted to move to Bulgaria. Yeah. As again, the company and stuff, the business aspects are pretty nice, but what I see here, I mean, that would have been a massive regret. It is really uh, looking very bad. Again, had a Bulgarian uh, border checking before we entered Turkey. Now we are at the Turkish border checking, and it looks so much nicer already. Look at the fence. You see the fence? Uh, you see the other well, side of the fence? Yes, there's a big fat fence. We have made it to Turkey. Yeah, I'm driving on the roads of Turkey. There was two checks: one for our passport and one for our passport our insurance papers and, the, and then cats and then they were checking our whatever we had in the car as well and the and cats no covid nothing yeah they didn't even ask for covid Yes, you have to pay a call on this, but it's worth paying. She has 
just breakfast and turkey and we have a full table again. It looks very tasty. Time to start eating. Yes. <laughs> so Barrett and I started going to the gym. Yes. And it has been three days continuous. And it's I think it's eight o'clock in the morning right now. Yeah. We woke up at seven getting more and more productive. <laughs> we just went grocery shopping, now we will get some coffee. Yeah. Where did we come from? Come, 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 oh my god. Such a chicken. Alina is still struggling to run through the Turkish roads. This is our favorite coffee shop. Another one. Orange. Cats and cats everywhere. We are sitting here in the car because um, mm. <laughs> there are some street dogs outside. They have followed us. So we are waiting till they go. Drinking our coffee. Coffee anyways and it's raining, it's comfortable. So no problem. And we have Wi-Fi. So <laughs> we are picking up Barrett's friend. His name is also Barrett. Yeah. And I started with him doing my bachelor's and he was in a different field. He was studying chemical or biotech. And now he's in Turkey, so that's super nice. We will be able to catch up after a long time. And I'm super tired because we slept at one o'clock and just woke up like five hours, no, six hours later. Now I'm here on the bus stop and I'm going to see where Bharat is. He should be coming in one of these buses. Most probably this bus. Guys, are you the poor buddy bus? The bus stop actually also looks a bit like in India. So today we are out with Alina and Bharat is taking photographs I think there. Another Bharat. Yeah, and we're out. We want to just take some walk. Uh, it looks want me to be in the shot. Pretty nice. Yeah. And Bharat, how do you like it so far? Super. Nice. Today is the day when my parents come and I and Bharat are chilling out a bit, just spending some time and the scenery is pretty beautiful here, I'll show you around. So there's somebody flying some kind of, I don't know what they want. Paraglide, I don't think so, some kind. The mountains look absolutely crazy. And then there's a very big tanker ship in front of us. Finally, after two plus years, we will be able to see each other again. 
हेलो लॉट्स ऑफ स्वीट्स हियर कॉफी एंड टी दिस इज फ्रॉम इंडिया देर इज अनादर पैकेट फ्रॉम इंडिया एंड बाल ऑल इट्स सो मच सो मच टर्कर स्वीट्स द इन लॉस ऑफ एजेंसी वाला जो नीचे वाला सो वी आर हैविंग सम टर्किश ब्रेकफास्ट I think that will be the first time to see a Turkish breakfast. Very true. So <laughs> I'm surprised for the reaction. Mm -hmm. uh, not my English is not. Or so now, how is the journey? Journey. Thakane wali thi, bahut thak gaye. Hmm. Lekin aane ki khushi thi ki ja rahe hain, ja rahe hain. Matto ke pas. Maza aaya. Dekhe na, aha. कितने घंटे की थी जर्नी छब्बीस घंटे सत्ताईस घंटे